What up, fam? So I want to talk about abundance today and my experience with it and with the lack of it, and also how I see it and why this is important for you, any of us trying to create more of it for ourselves. So I recently mentioned a lack of abundance in my life <laughs> uh, from a financial perspective, uh, financial scarcity currently. And I wanted to be transparent about that because I wanted to, there, there's a, a multitude of reasons, but one of the reasons is for this conversation, which is that I'm feeling very abundant in my life right now. Financials are the only thing that's not like, that box is not checked. So if not financial, then what else? Well, to me, abundance means anything beautiful in our lives. And so for me, that's why I posted on joy the other day and, and experienced a lot of joy in my life. Uh, that feeling of joy is abundance. That is abundance. There's also other ways that we can receive abundance that aren't financial, which is in relationships. We have good relationships. Uh, we have cool opportunities happening that aren't related to money. We have just in general beautiful things, wonderful things, exciting things, things that make us feel alive, flowing into our lives. What I see abundance as, again, this is personal. For me, abundance is kind of two, two things. Uh, one, and this is my spirituality speaking, uh, and so if you don't feel the same, that's okay, but I would challenge you to get curious about what abundance means to you. One, it is the universe supporting me. I am being, this this thing is being handed, you know, kind of gifted to me. It's been put in my life for uh, support. Excuse the sirens. Uh, and then the other piece of that is evidence that we are in alignment with ourselves and who we are meant to be evidence that we are showing up in the way that we should be, the way that we want to be, and it's the universe's way of responding to that and, and showing us, okay, you're, you're doing the right thing, uh, keep going, essentially. So again, personal belief, uh, I believe in those things very strongly though, didn't always believe this. <laughs> um, you know, in fact, if I watched this video five or 10 years ago, I would have just been like, who the hell are you speaking those things? So it's come through a lot of lived experience. With that, one of the beautiful things that I have in my life right now is that I had a dream opportunity come into my, fall into my lap. Well, not fall into my lap, I worked for it uh, a couple months ago. And I've talked about this a little bit here and there, but it is, as a content provider for a fantasy football site. So for those of you that are new or don't know me super well, this is probably like really off the wall and just like, what the fuck? But this is something that I've, I haven't really been open about, Like, but I'm just like a freak about football. I'm just obsessed. And I've been playing daily fantasy, like DraftKings and that shit for the past five or six years now. And yeah, that's a, it's a longer story, but uh, this dream opportunity for me, this this guy that I really respect and the brand that he has, and I I got to be a part of it. I was invited to be a part of it. And again, I did work to get there, um, but very in a very flowy manner. I followed my joy. I did things that excited me, make me felt alive. I had no expectations. I just kind of put myself out there and I received this opportunity. That is new in my life as of the past couple months, but that's incredibly fucking abundant. The financial piece of that is very small currently, um, but the energy of that is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Another example from today, I was talking to a client and they are building a business and she was talking about how she's had this, kind of gotten connected with this other circle of people that are kind of aligned, or, or not kind of, very aligned with what she's doing and where she's going in her life. That is fucking abundance. This like, she's like in this community just immediately, uh, just like, just such a beautiful thing for her. That is abundance. 
So anyways, I, yeah, I wanted to share about this today because abundance is this, this term that is thrown around a bunch in spiritual communities in this kind of uh, growth space. But I don't think we often take enough time to sit with what that actually means. And so, like I said, for you, I would just kind of ask yourself what is abundance to you and where do you have it in your life? Because there's a good chance that you have more than you may think on the surface because we just all naturally tend to think of financial abundance. So yeah, thanks for hanging out. I'd be curious about questions, comments on this. This is just like a very interesting topic to me. So thanks for hanging out and love you guys. Talk to you soon.